Hi Scorpio, welcome on my YouTube channel Beauty Master of Scorpio. Welcome for this uh, reading for the first 10 days of March 2024. Keep in mind, uh, Scorpio is a general reading, probably what no reason for all of you, but if you do like my channel, please like, share and subscribe if you want. I will be very thankful and grateful to support my channel. If you want to have a prayer reading with me, you'll find all the information in my description box below for a prayer reading. Now let's jump in, let's see what's going on for you guys. If you have someone rising Venus, whatever you have in Scorpio, that could be your reading. And this is a general reading. Tomorrow we'll upload the love reading. Let's see what's going on. My love team, please give me for my Scorpio. Now there are too many. And there are too many. Three or too many. I need one. My love team, please give me one oracle card for my Scorpio Uranus. Change and new beginning. Taurus in the house, which Uranus right now it's it's it is in um, in uh, Taurus in our seventh house. So partnership 101. Of course, there could be also um, partnership, love romance. Um, marriage, whatever, you understand what I want to say, but yeah, triumph, emotional union, emotional, what is that, spiritual union and emotional wheel draw, moving on on the knees, uh, 7, 8, 2, it's almost like you going back, um, forward and then go backwards, forward and backwards. You're, I think here you are all, of, all over the place, all over the place, um, meaning that um, somehow you're saying, okay, I'm out, I'm doing whatever I want to do, but at the same time you think about it like, let me think, I don't know. Let me know, I don't know if I should do it now, I don't know if I should do it later. I see here someone attached to you, uh, Scorpio. This is a John reading, guys. What well, doesn't look like that? <laughs> what I'm putting now. Um, um, numerology, seven, eight, uh, and two. All right, it's a um, 15, it's a 17, it's a 8, it's infinity. It feels almost like unfinished business. It feels like almost something with a soulmate, soul connection, uh, Scorpio. Uh, something here is significant. It's about to, to approach something. It's approach after uh, a silent treatment, after something that you had your tranquility, but also then probably, Scorpio. Or that could be also something that you love. We, we want to keep it general, right? Something that you love to do. He had like for a minute, like a pose, right? Something with a pose could be also, but let's see, boom. Something is shif shifting. Something is about to shake up here, Scorpio. If it's romantic or in career or your life, um, life purpose. Three of uh, pentacles, magician, fool, six of cups, challenge, ace of cups, hierophant, what you don't see coming, page of cups for the possible outcome, nine of cups, for the over energy and the knight of wands on their knees. Feels here, Scorpio, that you are manifesting something that without you know. You're manifesting something that you don't know if you can handle it. You're manifesting something that um, that it's it's difficult for you to understand if this still uh, feels to you feels to you belongs to you or could be also both of you. For me, this sounds 
this this situation that's why probably i cannot put it as like a journal but also either not like as love a reading scorpio because this for me this is pure uh, soulmate reading pure soulmate i don't know if you see sign music music uh, that you remind uh, this person uh if if you are think about them like no tomorrow uh, if you feel that they are thinking also, it's very difficult for you to detach from them. If you have dream about them, if uh, you like you're doing really everything to not think about it, but more you don't think about it and more is coming into your energy. When you think about them, you have a smile like that, and but then in the meantime, why are you saying, um, why don't, why they did not, or why they're not uh, coming towards me, or why it's not happening, why it's not happened, every, nothing, I cannot speak. To me, this energy, it's like you're meant to be together. Now, I don't know what a soulmate connection is that, for me, you're manifesting with other you know, and they're manifesting you without the they know. But it's very natural. It's nothing bad here. It's nothing that they are doing that in, in a bad intention or magic. No, either also you, Scorpio. You do that everything very natural with a smile like up here. This for me, unfinished business is for me something that have to be together, soul contract, life, past life relationship, endurance, it's here to let you, let you see if you want or don't know, or if you don't want, or if you don't, if you want or don't want. You know what is weird in the, in the last um, couple of weeks, if not months, Scorpio, I have very difficulty to talk. Especially in English. It's so weird. For, for a meanwhile, I, I was very wary. I was okay speaking in English. All of a sudden, since a couple of weeks, if not one, two months, <clears throat> <clears throat> Since Pluto arrived in the fourth house, my roots. Give me the nine of cups for the over energy. Yeah, you 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 think about them. It's a it's a pool connection here. It's a pool, and uh, I think about you. You think about me. Um, three of wands they are waiting for you you're waiting for them nothing is moving nothing is going on but then why i think about them but then why uh i'm so into this connection what's wrong with me is something wrong with me is something wrong with this connection is something wrong with this person it's nothing wrong with you scorpio this is failure this is unfinished business this is something that you cannot you cannot have any power over that, just to accept if you can. Accept that you think about them, embrace, surrender if you want, if you can. But it's destiny, this is meant to be. This is something that you think about them, they're thinking about. Now, I don't know which connection we are talking about. Again, it doesn't have to be necessarily romantic, but this is for sure a soul connection. <coughs> Give me the three of pentacles. Hierophant that's taken here, ace of swords, sun. Magician. Of course, scared. No, it's not the scares. It's, it's so freaking, freaking confusing, Scorpio. I see that. I, I bet. I bet. King of pentacles, queen of swords, and the seven of cups for you, focus. It's like, is something wrong with me? What the heck? Why I cannot move forward? Why I think about them? Why I still think about our plan, our future, what we wanted to do, what we wanted to create? 
or sand castle or whatever car, whatever you want at Scorpio, that this is freaking, it's, it's, uh, it's very difficult. <clears throat> You're doing, it's not that you're manifesting that you intend to manifest the situation. Again, you don't do that on purpose. Automatically, it's pulling you to you with other you want, Scorpio. Through dream, through meditation, through yoga, through fitness, through eating, through sleep, through work, through do, think whatever you want. It's, 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 uh, it's, on, it's not easy, Scorpio, I, I bet. And sometimes you think, it, I am crazy? Do I am crazy? It's starting to go something wrong in my mind. The current, you have the Hierophant, the Sun and the Ace of Swords for the Three of Pentacles. Because this is not only a, soul, only a soulmate, but this is your best friend. This is your, the half, the half, the half of the, your, your other side, right? The half of your heart the half of your soul, the half of your everything. And when you don't have it, it's something you're missing, Scorpio. You are not, if you tell me you're not complete, but not complete because you cannot be complete, uh, Scorpio. We don't talk about that. It doesn't mean that to control as an energy or to have as a person into your life so you, be, so you can be a control freak. No, we don't talk about that. We talk about the soul contract, a soul connection. <clears throat> two souls that they are, they're supposed to be in this time, life together, but they are apart. So we don't talk about only love, sex, and I don't know what. Uh, no, we don't talk about that. We're talking about uh, soul, the connection of your soul. Who is the match, who is the best match with? The half of the apple, right? The other half of the apple. <clears throat> Give me the six of cups. Move on, I have here a page of pentacles, eight of cups, knight of cups, magician again underneath. They have the same feeling, Scorpio. They feel the same. I don't know, it could be Scorpio, since you are not, or like if, if you are detached to this energy that you lost weight, you gain weight. Something about your physical uh, is changed, uh, Scorpio. Or you work out more, or you work out less. Or you have more, um, how you call that? You have more motivation or less motivation to do something. So it's everything okay, Scorpio. If you have all these uh, these symptoms, it's everything okay. You can breathe, Scorpio, because again, when we don't have this, the soul connection that we found in our life, and um, they are gone, or we are gone, or we guys, oh, both of us, it's gone. Um, like I said, the half piece of the apple. Without, uh, you know, we uh, ocean without uh, fish, um, a sky without birds, a Sahara desert without sand. The summer without the sun. They are having the same issue as it's, it's a it's a beautiful issue that uh, you can have, Scorpio. It's a beautiful issue because I say issue because it's not eternal. So you can be um, relaxed because this situation is meant to be together. That's it. This is <laughs> it's not a general reading. This is a soul reading, Scorpio. It's for me also very particular to to read as beautiful looks to me ace of cups for the challenge two of swords underneath a hack of confusion here page of swords four of swords and a nine of pentacles 
you tell me I have so difficulty <clears throat> to maintain myself concentrate during the day during my life purpose it's like you have you know when you have this question these so many questions that you're saying nobody can answer me and sometimes you think or you feel like pick up the phone and call them up if they feel the same i just give an example you dream so much about them almost say you want to call them up of course if you have the possibility to, to call them up and ask them did you did you dream also about me or oh, it's everything okay because i dream about that that and that this is your challenge of course but if it's almost you saying yeah i'm forced to to not call them up I, or i cannot call them up i don't know how they will respond me if i will call them up give me the hierophant for what Scorpius not see coming Something is dying, four of wands on the knees. Something is, is, needs to die or he died, Scorpio. In order to bring that back to, to the surface. No, I don't, I don't see a death. It's not a death of death. I see a, a death, a die, um, like something die. You know, when you had to die, metaphoric, your energy had to die, they energy had to die to, to embrace, to come back on track, the both of you? You're, it's like a awakening up. It's a wake up call here, Scorpio, from your side and from their side. But this could be also saying this situation can die so many times that we want, but it will come to the surface anyway. So why complicate the thing, right? Why we should complicate the thing if we are meant to be together? Again, don't have to be love, Scorpio. In that particular situation, you know, mean love means like romantic relationship. Don't have to either for some of you or is for sure. Page of Cups for the possible outcome. Queen of Pentacles, King of Wands, and the Seven of Wands. Magician again on the knees. I think, to be very honest with you, Scorpio, which I am, I think that you, both of you, both of you, you are manifesting. Either very shy, like, feels he almost said, none of you guys, not of you, none of you guys knows what to do or how to come forward, like being very shy. Probably you think this, the, something and they think the same way. Like, Probably they will block me. Probably they will uh, not open the door. Or probably, I don't know. But someone have to make here the first move, Scorpio. Someone have to make the first move. Because otherwise, <laughs> you wait and wait and you go more nuts. And they also. I know you want to know the sign. I have Leo, Gemini, Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus. Taurus and that's it. Yeah, that's it. These are very, very significant uh, signs. Of course, don't have to. Again, Taurus, Queen of Swords with them. Uh, no, pardon, okay, Taurus, uh, Gemini, Queen of Swords with Libra, and the Three of Cups. Yeah. 
again the magicians of and Pisces by the way underneath also Pisces <laughs> most of the time it's in the house um, you know what's going on here Scorpio if you see almost that you're starting to lose a little bit your patience with that situation but I think also them um, I see this, uh, you know, like bring this uh, together, back on track together, because you and them are manifesting that. So I see the, this is a soul connection. It's a soul contract. That's it. This man too. This man to be together. That's it. Cross watch also you if you're listening. This have to be. That's it. So don't wait. Call Scorpio. Scorpio. Call them. Whatever. Don't call. Pick up the car and go to them or cross watch or take the car and meet Scorpio because this is meant to be together, that's it. Scorpio, thumbs up. I come tomorrow with my love reading. Take care, stay safe and bye-bye.